Welcome. So what I'd like to do is um, kind of show you how to solve this multi-step equation. You can see I have three variables. And we're solving multi-step equations. The main important thing we want to do is uh, get the variables to one variable and get it to a two-step equation that we can solve. So we need to simplify. And the first thing I see about simplifying is getting rid of these parentheses. So I look at each parenthesis and see what operation is happening to the parenthesis. So x plus 13, there's really no operation that is in front of it that is happening to it. Here you can see I'm subtracting x minus 5. But really, subtracting x minus 5 is you're subtracting this whole expression. And to rather than subtract the whole expression, that's I'm kind of like mixing my words here. Um, but I'm subtracting this whole expression. So really, I'm subtracting x as well as subtracting a negative 5. Rather than kind of making that more confusing, rather what we just like to do is by subtracting each term is really the same thing as multiplying by that negative. Um, so therefore, that's going to give me a new term. So now let's rewrite this without this parenthesis and by applying this operation, which is negative x plus 5 plus 2x equals 0. So now you can see I have my three variables without any parentheses, which I can now combine. And to combine them, I like to rewrite the equation with my variables next to each other. So I write x minus x plus 2x. Then I write my constant, which would be negative 13. Make sure you carry the sign. Plus 5 equals 0. All right, well, x minus x is 0x. So therefore, I'm just going to leave me with 2x. And negative 13 plus 5 is going to leave me with a negative 8 equals 0. Now, to solve, I can just add 8 to both sides. And I have 2x equals 8 divided by 2 divided by 2 x equals 4. So there you go, ladies and gentlemen. That is how you solve your multi-step equation with 3 of the same variable. Thanks. Because the night is bottoms up.